What's going on guys? So I'm about to head to the gym of course. It's Monday, I think. It's Monday, right? And uh, we'll do a quick workout, but I want you guys to watch to the very end because we're gonna have a whole talk about what's coming up. It's almost the end of August. I was doing the August carnivore challenge. And I think today is when I decide if I'm gonna keep doing carnivore or what's next. And there's gonna be a lot of changes, not just the diet, the gym. I think I'm trying to optimize everything and I think I got it together in my head. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys after the gym. But first, uh, here's a little gym montage. I think I get good and then he switches it up said, oh, you didn't try this muscle yet. bring her to the gym she's like ah water water so I'm punching and she's like here comes a bottle I'll go, drink your water I'm like god damn Ugh. back back street gymmer what's up so we just left the gym about 20 minutes ago I had to come here at the beach and just kind of try to relax I think I overdid it a little bit today and I want to so we're being transparent I'm not gonna say oh I had an awesome workout look how amazing I am uh, I want to tell you what happened today. I think it was, it's not good. So I want to put in a disclaimer that just cause I'm doing what I'm doing and it's working for me, I'm not doing it as a tutorial because something, if you guys see something working for me, it could be fatal to you or it might not work to you or whatever. So don't, you gotta do your own research because today I, this is the closest I felt to having a heart attack. And this, so what happened is, for the last month since I started carnivore, and yes, I know I'm probably doing it wrong, but I haven't had energy. Once I get to the gym, I, I'm I'm dying out at 40 minutes to an hour. I just, my heart rate's high, just no energy. And that's with zero sugar and like 20 grams of carbs a day. Uh, and only water. So that being said, I'm like, dude, what's going on? Because the month before on strict car uh, keto and carbs from vegetables. I had tons of energy, even though it was my first week at the gym, I was going hard. So my uh, my trainer, I'm like, dude, 
I feel like I'm letting him down because I'm supposed to be getting better, not slower. And at my gym, they sell protein powder, stuff like that for weightlifters. And one of the guys said, well, try this pre-workout. And it's called C4. I did no research on it, but everybody recommended it. Um, which is, I should have did research first because these guys are on a different diet. They're not losing weight. They're not on sugar. They're not counting calories. They're not on zero sugar or carbs for sure. They're eating like five, 6,000 calories a day. But, so I was like, ah, screw it. I'm 20 minutes early for the gym. This takes 20 minutes to work. I took the C4 pre-workout. Uh, that's what it's called, it's pre-workout. And uh, it, I'll tell you what, it worked. But I think it's just concentrated sugar. I don't know what it is. I'll put it on the screen. I've never had it before. And basically, I had energy, man. I was going, my, my trainer's like, Jesus, like you're twice as fast, twice as energetic. But the problem was my heart rate, I had, I had to take breaks every five minutes or something because my heart rate was like 170 or higher sometimes. And I'm like, dude, I got energy all day, but I'm, I'm gonna have a freaking heart attack. And then when we sat down after the, uh, when I was done with the whole thing, these guys were talking, I'm like, oh my God, I have such heart pain right now. I feel like I'm having a heart attack. You know, my arms were tingly, my, my chest was, killing me I thought it was the muscle at first but I never had that bad of heart pain and uh, then I got to thinking about it I'm on zero sugar and for the last 67 days my editor can correct me I don't know what day it is for sure but um, zero sugar and then right before a really hard workout I drank that concentrated pre-workout which is like supposed to give you energy it's like downing two energy drinks so of course, you know, that would have messed up my heart rate and get me my heart going fast. Plus the workout was getting my heart working. So I'm not doing that. Long story short, well shorter, I'm not doing that again. My heart is still like driving home. I was like, I have no, I don't know. I shouldn't have done that. I shouldn't have done that. I, f I felt like I was having a heart attack. Even now I'm like super weak. Um, even though I have energy, it's, it's hard to explain, but I'm not gonna be doing that anymore. That being said, if I feel that weak at, a, at, at, at my gym, and my gym is supposed to be optimized to help me lose weight and get stronger, I need to optimize the diet. And I, this is really gonna disappoint my carnivore friends, but I gotta, get, I gotta do what works for me. And I don't wanna bash carnivore because I've seen it work for a lot of people, a lot of, some guys have messed with me, lost 150 pounds and whatever. But I have a feeling, coming off my American diet of eat whatever the hell I want, whenever the hell I want, not caring about anything, uh, I could have I could have went on any diet on the planet and I would have lost weight. So, you know what I mean? It, any diet would have worked. So, I know it works, but going to the gym as rigorously as I am, I need something else. I need carbs. Um, so. I am changing the diet. I kind of been hinting at it all month because I feel like shit. And don't get me wrong, like I said, you guys been giving me lots of tips. I'm not having enough fat. I'm not having enough electrolytes or salt. Like all these things. And I've seriously optimized all of it. You know, I've added more fat than I can freaking eat. I've added, you guys saw my last video, I'm adding like, I'm eating entire spoons of Himalayan salt at once. I'm, I've done everything I could possibly think of, uh, vitamin, E, vitamin B, E, vitamin D, C, folate, <laughs> it, it doesn't matter, you know, I'm just, anyways, all month, talking to experts, my local friends, uh, I've kind of optimized the perfect, what I think will be the perfect diet, exercise plan for me. Um, I'm not going to talk, well, tomorrow we'll go shopping and we'll talk about what it actually is. Uh, it's I'm optimizing every single thing I'm doing eating times that I'm eating drinking times that I'm gymming what kind of gym workouts I'm doing per day what days I have off what I'm gonna do on days off um, optimization of supplement everything everything I'm September is gonna be my hardest yet most efficient month of this thing even though it's only day 67 or 69 whatever it is so yeah I'm sorry to say, well, I'm not sorry, it's my body, um, but I'm, I'm, I'm getting rid of carnivore. I don't want to, 
I don't want to give what I'm doing a name, maybe Ketovore, because it's the main point is it's going to be, I have a list of every vitamin and nutrient that the human body needs and how much per day. I'm going to be optimizing that in a super low carb diet. So I'm going to be getting all my carbs from vegetable. Anyway, we'll talk about that tomorrow. But all I can say is if you're on zero sugar and carbs, don't go do a hard workout right and take a pre a pre workout drink cuz I thought I was going to have a heart attack boxing that hard. I guess that's it. Uh like I said, not every day is roses, but in the end, in the end, I still got a badass workout and we're progressing. And everything, nothing is regret, everything is learning. So now I know and I can't wait for tomorrow. So dude, that reminds me uh it makes me think like before this whole diet like three four months ago i was drinking two monsters at a time right before a dive or right before anything and i didn't feel anything like two monsters or two red bulls they didn't affect me at all and now i just had one pre-workout which is basically maybe a monster energy drink or the equivalent and i thought i was dying so something in my body is working i'm not carb dependent i'm not sugar dependent like for once this caffeine or this sugar is affecting my body and I, I can't explain it but energy drinks have never gave me energy before and now they're like <laughs> that's got to be good right anyways guys i will see you tomorrow and uh put the emoji the lightning because i still have a ton of energy the lightning emoji in the comments below to let me know that you watched the whole video see you guys Don't wanna sleep in, cause I got something to prove I gotta take what I hate and finally make a move I think of you and all the shit you don't do Well I'ma make hella sure that I don't